guys, it's me Miranda and today I have a very special surprise. Basically, as you know, I have lots of boyfriends, lots of bays, but I want to get more. The best way to get more boyfriends? Stalk them. So I'm an expert stalker, but I want to get even better. So I'm going to learn how to be a contortionist today, which means when you can twist your body like a pretzel, see I'm very flexible, and you can fit into small things. And I love fitting into small things, small holes, and that will help me to stalk my bays better. I called a contortionist and she should be here any minute, so we're just waiting for her. Yes. Hi. Oh, hi. Come hi. in. Hi. What's your name? Uh, Sophie. Sophie. Hello. Thank you for coming here, Sophie. This is Sophie. Um, I found her on YouTube. So she has a little bit of famousness because she was on America's Got Talent. And also she was on YouTube. So for any of you who haven't heard of her, that's what she did. So she's a contortionist and she's going to teach me how to contortionize so that I can stalk people better. I mean, so that I can be flexible. So Yeah. How okay. do you start it? So, so first of all, I'm surprised you're not already in a ball. I thought you were going to roll in like, well, in a ball. I mean, like... You can. You can just, you know, just stand normal. I am pretty already, so REA plus. So then you just arch back. I'm pretty sure I heard what? I'm pretty sure I heard your bones break. This is strange. You look like a tarantula. Well, this actually will be good for me because you can smell and make sure things are French. I've always wanted to be able to do something like that. So in case you ever want to stalk people or make sure things are fresh and smell nice, this is a good position to get in. Do you yeah. get Arms up. So arms up and now bend backwards. Like this? Um, yeah. I did it. I mean, it's a little bit more like bent back, but. Well, lift my legs up because your head was in between your legs. So it's, it's this way. So the other way. Like that way? Yeah. Oh. Like this? Yeah. Sure. Good. Got yeah. it. That was easy. So what's next? You can be standing up again. Okay. Easy. And then just like grab your leg. Yes. And then from there, pull it. Pull it. To your chin. Ow! How long do you do that? You That's just, super painful. Just like, can't you just go this way? Ow! Well, See? you can go this oh, way geez. and then also move it. Move that it. way. This is too painful for me um, because my legs are more mature than yours. Um, so that's why they don't do that. Can I borrow your legs? Okay, so I'm gonna lay down. Now you're gonna get on my back and you're gonna give me your legs. There we go. Oh, yes, okay. Like this. See, I did it. Does it look like it? Point your toes, be a professional. So there, now I was able to do it. So now um, yeah. I need to learn how to get inside of things so that I can hide from people and stalk them. So I have a couple things. One, um, my boyfriend, Joey Grasefanisva, is in Tokyo right now. And so I need to get to him, but he has a restraining order. So I need to get to him through a suitcase. I'm also not allowed to fly. So um, can you teach me how to get inside of a suitcase? Because right now, watch this. When I get in it, um, it's just really, it's, yeah, too big because it doesn't zip. See how it doesn't? I've been yeah. trying to get it zipped and I can't, so. Okay. Can you actually show me how to zip it? How you get into it, so you put your knee in the corner. Okay. And then you put the rest of your body on the side. Okay. And then you just like bend back and then you can zip it up. Oh, it does actually zip. So looky that. So now um, that's perfect. So now I know how to do it. Wow. Okay, so now I can try it. So you put your knee. Okay. Yeah, your Crocs might get in the way. Well, don't ask me to take off my clothes. That's enough for pants. Okay, so now I go in here and I bend it. Yeah, you say so you then. Ugh. Ow! I poked a rib. So, zip it. Okay. <laughs> zip it up. Zip it up. I mean, it doesn't zip. How am I supposed to get to Japan if it's not zipped? Um, maybe you need a bigger suitcase? Are you calling me fat so now you're body shaming me? <gasps> She's body shaming no. me. I'm not fat. I'm perfectly proportioned. You are. Thank you. All right, so um, I will keep working on this and stretching on this one. Another thing I like to do to my boyfriends is send them a present 
that is myself. But recently they have caught on because I've been using refrigerator boxes and they're too big. So I need to try to fit into a smaller box. So, yeah. so here's this box. I can fit my feet in this one, but not my whole body because I need to tape it shut. So you, you can just like bend backwards into it and then from there just like twist to the side and then you can just like close it up. And then it's easy because then you can like close it up yourself and then ship right. it yourself. Um, that looks really easy, so, so. Yeah. Okay, well let me do it now. With your legs? Yeah, go in with your legs. And then you and go then backwards. Go backwards. So, yeah. Like this? Yeah, and then you just gotta like close it up a little bit. There. Yeah. Your boyfriends won't know what's in the box. Like, Surprise! So, okay. This is really good. So do you stay in these things often? Yeah, you know, it's really easy to travel like this because you know, you just like put the box there and, and then you just, just like cut it. a hole for food and pee pee and things like that. See, my uncle has mastered how to get into a suitcase, but I haven't figured that one out yet. So I can actually just access for him, for his help. Okay, so there's one last thing I need your help with. Now I know how to ship myself to my boyfriends, give my boyfriends presents of myself, hide in their small closets, things like that. Yeah. But I also want to surprise them with a really incredible dance. I always dance for my boyfriends, but one thing I wish I had a little bit more of was flexibility. And you're very flexible. So I thought maybe I can use your legs because your legs are so flexible. You can just like do that. Right, like that. Um, I think that will be really appealing to all my bays. So maybe um, I can have your legs. How so are you gonna do that? Well, you could cut them off. I mean, I, think I there's kind a surgery. of need my legs to like You could walk. have mine probably. They could give you mine, I could have yours. Is there a surgery that does that? Is there one? Okay, that won't work. So okay. how about this? I have some pants, so you can put these on. So now lay on the ground on your back for me. Don't worry, this will hurt you much more than it will hurt me. so much so now all you have to do is just give me your legs and we'll be good so yeah I mean I think that's kind of gonna be a little very difficult but it doesn't sound that hard to me it just sounds like you might die and then I get your legs so that doesn't sound that difficult so since um rest in peace to Sophie here so if you guys want to go subscribe to her um that would be really nice of you so that then she can have some subscribers in memory of her life um y yeah Go do that. So. Yeah, go go subscribe before she dies. No offense, just I need your legs. So yeah, yeah. yeah I mean, understandable. Yeah. So, I think I have a knife somewhere, so I'll get that. So okay. thanks for watching. I'm getting a knife. <laughs> hey guys. Um, I hope you like my video. If you did, make sure to subscribe, but then push the bell notifications because subscribing doesn't mean anything anymore because YouTube is so cool. So even if you're subscribed to a channel, they don't like to tell people about it. <laughs> so awesome. Anyways, um, so make sure to push the bell notifications. Also, I just wanna remind you, my book, my diary, which is all my diaries duct taped together, is still coming out this summer, and I'm freaking out about it. Because Simon & Schuster, the book company, they stole my freaking book. They stole all my freaking diaries that I duct taped together, and now they're selling it. And they sent me a copy to taunt me. And so this is what it looks like. So. Make sure to find it everywhere when it comes out this summer. Pre-order it now. Get it off the shelves because all my biggest secrets are in this freaking book. I don't want people reading it because everything is in here. 
Like literally, my boyfriends, my kisses, my secrets, how I really feel about my monthly and does all that. So make sure I pre-order it so that no one else buys it. And also one last thing, make sure I get tickets to my tour. It's my last tour I'm ever gonna do. Um, I'm retiring. So make sure I get tickets to that. All right, that's pretty much it, bye.